those who are dying to play marvel heroes omega and can't wait any longer i'm going to be showing you how you can download it on pc of course and uh play it for yourself and try out 3.0 for yourself so i'm gonna have the link either in the description or a pinned comment this is the link you bring up the link this is gonna be real quick too real simple boys real simple this basically explains like you know what's happened with the uh you know the witchy call or whatever uh what you're gonna do is hit mh server you're gonna download the server zip once you download that you're gonna open up that server zip but you're gonna make want to make a uh make a make a new folder okay make a new folder I have a folder called 3.0 just, you know, for the fact of making it 3.0 or whatever. Um, and uh, so what you're going to want to do here is you can read this and make sure you already have a copy of Marvel Heroes Omega somewhere. As long as you have it on Steam or just anywhere, if you can install it, that would be really it would make it a lot easier. Um, I really don't know Della from Steam if you still have the game in your library. Um, yeah, I, like, I guess you might just have to find a Marvel Heroes download somewhere. I, I don't know how that would work, but uh, those who have Marvel Heroes on Steam, like already, this will be a lot easier for you guys. And I'm so sorry if you don't have uh, Marvel Heroes on Steam. Uh, I have no clue. I'll look at it. I'll take a look at it. But so what you're going to want to do here is first click start server bet right this will start up the server emulator and let the server emulation run wait until it stops running okay so i'm gonna click it here it's gonna run mu uh mh server mu it's gonna run all this info and stuff like that and um now there's two things you can do here you can either hit start client um that which will bring you to the logging screen and if you want to you can make a uh you can make a account like a just a fake account like just put anything don't use your real email or any passwords that you would actually use um but uh you can make an account by copy and pasting this uh this link right here while having the server up you have to have the server up while uh while um uh searching up this link uh otherwise it won't work but so after that you hit start client bat log in and you're good to go for the sake of uh just hopping in quicker honestly i would say just do auto login bat it's gonna save your progress anyways um we hit start auto login bat after hitting the join and as long as you have marvel heroes installed already or you know you figured out a way to get marvel heroes omega well actually actually wait 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 i'm actually i just missed the step i missed the step you have to do uh set up sorcerer supreme uh hold on god damn it god damn it back me out back me out back out of this okay all right so you're gonna have to hit sorcerer supreme and you're going to have to, it's gonna ask you uh, to set the file location, you know, or the folder location of Marvel Heroes Omega. And then that's how it connects to, you know, I guess the server or whatever, whatever, something like that, right? So basically, that's basically all you need to do, boys. That's literally it. You saw the game launched. Um, Nothing more or else I really need to show. I mean, that's, that's just about it. As long as you have Marvel Heroes Omega already somehow, this is going to be a lot easier if you don't. Um, I'm not too sure how that's going to work. Bear with me, boys. Bear with me. I will try to figure it out and we will we will come up with a solution. Yeah, like I said, very quick, very quick. Uh, that's just about it, though. This is going to go up late. So if you're up late at night dying to play Marvel Heroes Omega, here you go, brother.